What's good, everybody? It is Chris Crazy House back again on Thursday night on the DMBO show. Better act like you know. So listen, guys, you know, I don't know what it's like in your neck of the woods, but here in Tennessee is actually still snowing. Like we got some snow early in the week and it's, it's weird. It's like spring is trying to creep through, but winter just won't won't let go. Is that it's like winter has spring in the figure four <laughs> leg lock or something like that. And it's trying to get spring to tap out somehow. But, you know, spring is trying to get it on through there. And but, you know, winter just keeps pushing through it whenever it feels like it. Almost like Debo or something like that. So in the celebration of the fact that we still have some winter time here, and I know around the country there is still some winter time in your area and your neck of the woods as well. I'm going to be doing some awesome Arctic adventures. I'm going to be drawing some cute little animals, doing some fun winter activities, whether it be ice skating or snowboarding or also going flying around in a sled. So that's what we're going to be doing tonight on this edition of Drawing My Butt Off. So I hope you guys will stick with me and watch me draw these cute little critters. I'll start off with two of them and then I'll do one after the intermission and we'll have three all together in this cute little Arctic setting doing some fun winter activities. So please stick with me tonight and I hope you'll enjoy and relax while I'm doing this. If you want to just listen to the music, you can do so and watch me draw. If you want to uh, talk with me and have a conversation within the live chat, we can do that as well. I'm, I will be here and available for you to ask any questions that maybe about my artwork, how I've done this, or if you have any questions about any projects I've done in the past or are working on in the future, please do so in the live chat. What I wanted to say before we get going, I'm going to hit that intro and then I'll jump right into drawing these winter critters. But let me just say, if you are so inclined, if you liked my leaping leprechaun that I designed this week on this channel, you can go get the coloring page exclusively on my Patreon. So the Leaping Leprechaun coloring page is available for you to go download, print out, and color. Or if you are someone who likes doing digital artwork and digital colors, you can just download it to your computer, take it into Photoshop, and color it that way. All up to you. It's a fun little coloring page for my fans out there, and I know the youngsters will enjoy it, and some adults might enjoy it as well. So before let's get going, I'm going to hit that intro and we're going to jump right into drawing some awesome Arctic adventures. Let's go.
right, here we go with the intermission point, folks. What we got right here, I just finished doing two critters, doing some winter antics and having some fun out in the snow. First up, we got the radical penguin riding down on his snowboard, riding down the mountain. And I, I think he looks cool. I think this one is my, my favorite character out of the three that I've designed for this video. I just think he, he looks cool. I like the mohawk. Uh, I like the, the glasses or the goggles and the, the, the red vest and a snowboard. Lots of fun doing that one. I've always been into extreme sports like snowboarding and skateboarding. So this was a lot of fun to put together. Moving on, we have the cute little Arctic fox. If you follow me on this channel, you've seen me draw these little fox characters doing different things, and I wanted to do something somewhat similar but a little bit different. So I created my own version of the Arctic Fox, and this one, she's out here skating on the ice, having some fun. You can see the big smile on her face. I changed the colors up a bit, basically because it is an Arctic Fox. So very similar design as far as like the way I designed the head and the, the facial features and the tail and whatnot. But we changed the colors to, you know, just so we can know that we are in an Arctic winter setting. And like I said, she's having fun skating out there on the ice. Uh, I did a little bit different with the, if you look at the actual ice, I decided to change the contour lines so they weren't completely black. That's just to give them, it helps to give that more of a, an illusion for ice or anything that you can kind of see through. It gives that, you know, just a very quick illusion for art and animation. So that's just a tip for you guys out there to, if you're doing any type of water or if you're doing any type of ice or crystals or whatever, sometimes it helps to change those contour lines. Don't just leave them black. Change them to a different color. And I use a shade of blue that sort of helped out, giving it that ice feel. So I hope you guys have enjoyed what we've seen so far. I will be back in the second part when I do... Uh, a polar bear riding on a sled. We'll see how that goes. But before I get to that, I just wanted to say if you haven't liked this video, go ahead and make sure you go down there and hit the like button. And also, if you enjoy my artwork and my coloring pages that I have created, you can go to my Patreon right now. The artwork that I did last week on drawing my butt off the Mecha Core is available as a coloring page. You can go get that and download it to your computer, color it that way, or you can print it out and color it with some markers or maybe color pencils or whatever coloring utensils you might have. You can go ahead and color it that way as well. So that is available now for the, the $5 tier. So it's $5 a month. You can download all my exclusive coloring pages, all of my exclusive background art for your whatever pleasures you want to use them for. So you can go do that now on Patreon. The link will be at the bottom in the description box. Before we get into our next section, I will be playing a quick ad for my comic book, Knuckleheads, the very first comic book that I ever created and put out for sale. And all three issues of Knuckleheads are available now at my online store. Once again, the link for that will be in the description box as well as the comments section for you folks that want to pick up Knuckleheads. And if you have... I know a lot of people have the first issue, but issues two and three are also available on my online store. So we're going to play an ad for that and then jump right into drawing some more awesome Arctic adventures. Let's go. Angie is an imaginative 10-year-old who dreams of one day going on exciting adventures with her Uncle Junior. Too bad her imagination has made her a social outcast amongst her classmates. All of that changes when Angie receives a mysterious gift from her uncle that causes her to be hunted by evil creatures from the realm of nightmares.
our only hope is a heroic crew of rebels known as the Knuckleheads. Buy Knuckleheads number one. On sale now at ChrisCrazyHouse.com.
Yes, indeed. Here we are with the final awesome Arctic Adventure artwork. And I have drawn a polar bear riding on a sled. And not just riding on it, but he's going up off of a ramp, flying into the air. You can see the joy and the happiness on his face. I was trying to capture that that happiness and joy that we see during winter time, especially if you think back to when you were a child and how much fun you used to have playing out in the snow before you got old enough to where you had to shovel it. <laughs> like I did where you got, once you got a little bit older, snow wasn't as fun anymore because you had to clean up, shovel and, you know, clear the ice and pour down salt and all this other stuff. And it wasn't as much fun anymore. But I do get joy out of seeing my daughter play out in the snow when she plays out in the backyard when it snows here. But I hope you guys like this polar bear having some fun on the sled. I enjoyed making him for you, especially with making it not just him, but the other little Arctic adventure critters, the penguin going down on the snowboard and the little fox, Arctic fox character having fun on the ice doing her little skating this was a, a joy to put together i enjoy drawing these little cute little animals and i do know that i do have fans that enjoy this as well and if you have some youngsters that are into artwork and will just want to see some fun artwork done by someone that looks like them you can always show them these videos i think they will get a big kick out of it so i appreciate having you guys here on Thursday night, watch me draw. Uh, there will definitely be more of these types of characters posted on my page and on my YouTube channel. So make sure you go ahead and you follow me here by subscribing to this YouTube channel and hitting that notification bell. So that way that you know anytime I upload any of these new art projects. Okay. Uh, also to let you know that these these critters that I drew tonight will be available as coloring pages on my Patreon, five bucks a month, and you can download an unlimited amount of my exclusive coloring pages, and you can get them all on Patreon. Like I said, for five bucks a month, you can just download the artwork and print it out on your home computer, or if you're a digital artist, you can just go ahead and do the artwork yourself in Photoshop, or if you're like me, use Adobe Animate to do all your colors, just like I do here on drawing my butt off. Once again, guys, I appreciate you. Make sure you go ahead and subscribe. Make sure you like this video and make sure you go ahead and share it with anyone who would enjoy this type of artwork. I appreciate you and I will be seeing you guys next week on Thursday night when I'll be drawing my butt off. Chris Crazy House, peace out.